Hi loves. So time today for the Selen's PHA plus Bio Peel Resurfacing Facial Pads, um, a review on these. <laughs> so these came in my Caroline Hirons Peel Off Balance or something like, I can't figure it out. So we're going to just, just try to roll with it. Um, I feel like everything's a little bit crooked. Uh, these came in the Caroline Hines Call Beauty box. They retail for 65 pounds um, on the Call Beauty website. And as soon as I saw that, I was like, ooh, it's kind of uh, steep. Um, so she loves these as uh, toning, toning pads, right? Like acid tones. There we go. Um, and I've been going through a phase with acid toners where I found a bunch that I really like. So I really like the P50 from Biologie Recherche. Recherche. I will leave my review to that down below. I think it's a great video. And I've really, really been enjoying the uh, Dennis Gross ones. Those ones I think I haven't filmed a review for yet, so I'm pretty sure it's coming up next week. Um, but like, I'm having these love affair, this love affair with acetoner, so I thought I would really enjoy these ones. And I don't really. And when I saw that they were 65 pounds, I'm like, that is steep. So you only actually get 50 um, pads in here. And um, they're supposed to, they have alpha and beta hydroxic acid. They're supposed to resurface, gently exfoliate, um, re like refine the skin, even out skin tone, all that kind of great thing. All that kind of stuff that um, a great acetone is supposed to do. I only use these in the evening because I do find them to be quite strong. And I do make sure that I wear sunscreen on the day after it. Because just when you're exfoliating, you're exposing that, you know, layer of fresh skin. You want to make sure you're protecting it from the sun. So I kept, kept, the, bo kept the box to show you guys. Um, and then it opens up like so. And this is the um, the packaging, which again, at 65 pounds, I'm like, you could give me like a glass container or a slightly, I don't know, prettier <laughs> container. Um, and then I can smell it already. They just come in, um, let's try to take one out. They're just kind of like little round. Oh, you can smell that acid. Um, that's the shape. Uh, and so it is quite a strong acid. So even with a, after a couple of weeks of using them, I still feel that my eyes tingle when I use them. So I actually have to close my eyes when I'm using them. And I use them the way I would any acid toner. So I go across the face, obviously not across my eyes, um, across the face and then I flip it over and go the other way around. Um, and the thing is like they smell like they're really strong acid. On the skin, they don't tingle like a very strong acid, and the result that I get the next day is not that like, whew, my skin really got a good exfoliation resurfacing, um, which is weird, again, because this, from the smell and the ingredients, you would think that you're going to get that like kick. So I don't know. It's kind They're kind of a bust for me because they're really expensive, and I don't really feel like they're doing what they're supposed to do, and they're, they irritate my eyes without giving me any kind of um, effect. So... Um, I don't think I'm going to give them away. I think I'll still use them, especially because they're easy. They're pre-moistened towelettes, right? Um, so you don't have to like worry about putting them on anything, especially for travel or what have you. But I definitely will not be repurchasing them. And it is a bummer because I was hoping I would love them. So that is my review on these guys. Let me know if you've tried it out. I think Sadie said that she tried them out and hadn't really liked them. So let me know if you guys have um, and your thoughts on them. Let me know what other acid toners you're really liking re recently. And yeah, that's about it for me today. So let me do some points of positivity and we'll be done. My first point of positivity is that my mom just called and we're going to go to the movies tonight. So I'm excited to do that. Got all gussied up and I've got some place to go. <laughs> um, my second point of positivity is finding some time to just sit and read. I haven't had a chance to do that. So I'm really excited about that. And then my third point of positivity is I'm going away for the weekend uh, next weekend to go see a sweet friend. And I am so excited to go celebrate with her. Um, so yeah, that is it for me today. As always, please let me know what's making you guys smile. Thank you for hanging out today. I will catch you all soon. Uh, before I leave you, as always, let me remind you that life is just way too short to wear boring lipstick. Bye, guys.